guys, River Bluff Baggers here with you, and this is the house we got to stay in for the Spring Fling Rally 2022, the sixth annual Spring Fling in Eureka Springs, Arkansas. Jeff from the Cat House and Andy from the Switchback Bar helped put us up in this house. We had a garage that was big enough to hold eight bikes easily, so we all got to park our bikes inside in case the weather got bad, which it did not. Beautiful weather the whole time we was there. This house was located on Beaver Lake, which is about a 20 minute ride to Eureka Springs downtown. So, we enjoyed the little jaunt back and forth to town each day. The scenery out here is just beautiful. If you haven't been to Beaver Lake, we suggest you go check it out. Take your family and spend the week. It's just beautiful down here. And if you're riding a motorcycle, we suggest you take a week and just ride the roads in Eureka Springs during the Spring Fling Rally. The Spring Fling Rally is usually the weekend before or the weekend after Easter, depending on when it falls in the month. Now here's overlooking Beaver Lake. Man, just look at the views here. Just phenomenal. Just look at the mountains and the water all together. It's just breathtaking. I'm just almost lost for words here. I can only imagine what the roads in these mountains are like. The Spring Fling Rally is the kickoff to a riding season. So, if you're anxious in the winter time and you want to go, go somewhere to ride your bike, we suggest the Spring Fling in Eureka Springs to start off your riding season. Now here's Beaver Lake. Man, just beautiful. The water's clear, just smooth. We had a great time. Here's some of the people that was with us in the house, riding the Ozarks, Firecracker on two wheels, JS, and Ozark HD rides and his wife, Brenda. At the southwest end of the main street of Eureka Springs sits the Cat House Lounge, a popular spot for the bikers who have come to this area to ride the iconic pig trail or to explore all the great roads that can be found in northwest Arkansas and nearby southern Missouri. The Cat House Lounge was the epicenter of action during this year's Spring Fling 2022 Motorcycle Rally. The parking lot was full of bikes, the balconies and patios were filled with bikers, the atmosphere full of fun, and the mountain slopes on both sides of Main Street were full of the sounds of revving and roaring motorcycles, all making their way to the Cat House Lounge. The Cat House features a full restaurant and several bar areas with a menu full of a variety of foods from burgers, sandwiches, steaks, and even a few Irish pub items thrown in the mix. Ask people who have traveled to Eureka Springs, Arkansas what they think, and they will tell you it is one of their favorite places to visit. Nestled in the Ozark Mountains of Northwest Arkansas, the whole town is on the National Register of Historic Places. Because of the mountainous terrain, the streets and sidewalks all go up and down in elevation and wind all around this beautiful town. The town is full of stone buildings, Victorian style mansions and cottages, as well as extensive sidewalks and staircases that are used to maneuver around the different levels of the town as it is built on the steep mountain slopes. A straight and level street in Eureka Springs is a rarity. You can see on the lower level the owner of the cat house, Jeff. Adam Sandoval from Adam Sandoval Rides and the owner of the River Campground, they're sitting in the peace of a quiet Sunday morning, 
the calm before the storm of the last day of the Spring Fling 2022 Motorcycle Rally. The River Bluff Baggers would like to thank Jeff and all the hard workers in the Cat House Lounge for their hospitality and their excellent hosting of the Spring Fling Motorcycle Rally. On this day here, you can see that we have come into the switchback bar. Just got back from the uh, the Hog Wild Poker Run, which was one of the events that uh, was going on at Spring Fling. Uh, Andy and Carrie are the owners of the switchback bar, and he had said something this day that uh, they thought they might have broke a record attendance. There was a lot of bikes there, as you can tell. Uh, switchback bar is approximately 10 miles north of the Eureka Springs downtown area. It's located on Highway 23 on the Arkansas-Missouri state line. This view here you can see all the motorcycles. To be honest with you, uh, probably 40 to 50 bikes had left before we get our picture taken here. But by these pictures you're seeing here that the, the view is absolutely beautiful and the roads around this place is just incredible. I believe that our poker run ended up being 113 miles and all of us finished safely and got back in time. On the left hand side, this is the bar area. Uh, there's a deck there in the front and if you go on the inside is where the bar is. There's a place to dance, there's usually live music going on. And off to the right is just another pavilion, just a deck area uh, where people sit and enjoy each other and talk. Uh, one thing about this place, you always see Andy and Carrie out talking to people, visiting, checking on everybody and making sure they're getting what they need and all things are good for everybody. I can say every time that the River Bluff backers go into this place, they will, or go into Eureka Springs, they will always stop at uh, the switchback bar.